Hello ladies, I'm going to make another a second uh, video about this crazy quilt because someone uh, suggests me that uh, the first was so quickly and could not see clearly. So I will try to slow down <laughs> my voice and my camera, focus it in a better way. Uh, this is the block uh, that I make with the... Um, all kind of fabrics I use uh, for those uh, the leftovers of other projects, projects, or also and also uh, use cloth that I don't use it anymore. For example, this piece was from a blouse that I didn't like it any, anymore. So this is a, a deming from an old jean and. That is what I use for do this kind of block. And after that, I put together the blocks and I start embellishing this crazy quill. And ca as you can see, this is a, a little joyo and uh, and also a lot of stitches that I I I know some of the names but not all of those this is a, a feather stitch and um, a chain stitch uh, but I want instead of tell you the names because I don't know all of them to see uh, in more detail and more slowly what I made with those blocks this is a little piece of fabric that I uh, sew into a, a little flower uh, and uh, I use uh, several stitches to make the branches and the leaves and here is a, a some crochet applique that I make that I uh, sometimes make in advance before and I put it away a size and use it in a future for a future project if, if this is the case this is a whole uh, a button and a bee and uh, all kind of stitches this is another joyo make into a flower and here's the next is the uh, this is a piece of fabric uh, sew it with uh, a lot of stitches and uh, this is a little kind of uh, spire web I'm practicing all uh, I am learning and also beside I have the book of uh, stitches couple books so I I am stitching and checking my book all the time trying to learn and practice and another stitches are a combination of them and uh, something like that this is a, a stitch that uh, allow you to put uh, a bit into the like a little cocoon something like that and you can I see it also using mirrors little mirrors that is the case I, that was uh, uh, practicing. I was practicing this in another piece of fabric and I cut it and I decided to incorporate it in, into the quilt. This is uh, also um, a button, like a little flower or song. And all kind of stitches. And, uh, also I'm, I'm trying to be creative and, and, and do my, my own stitches. This is another um, a spire web and uh, I just trying to give you m more more and more slowly motion the, the what I, I made in this quill um, also uh, this is this is just a uh, long stitch and I start stitching uh, little 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 things uh, along along that. This is a flower that I start making. It's just uh, a kind of free creating thing. That's why I like it because you can make all kind of kind of 
um, creations. This is a, a, a kind of grid that I start making in other in other kind of project, and uh, it was a good idea in, in the, at this at this point to incorporate it in, in my quill. It's 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 easy. It's easy. I I I saw this a first time on TV. They use this kind of stuff in a uh, white work uh, embroidery. I just uh, do it in my way. I always like to <laughs> to to I mean alter things and change things in my in my kind of point of view. Of course, the idea, the main idea is is, is from the expert right or, or people who, who like to do more kind of this stuff but I mean the thing is to be creative this is another um, kerchief flower and this is another um, joyo uh, make it into a flower uh, this uh, uh, little uh, other kind of small flowers crochet flowers that I put here I mean, saw here and also put a little bit on it and um, but those all those stitches you can find it in um, um, a stitch book that you can buy I have one that uh, my my husband bought, bought, bought for me bought, bought for me on Christmas last Christmas and the other I, I, I found in a used store book uh, used a book store and it was a good price so I bought it and um, this is a, a little thing that I like a little I don't know like a little um, pumpkin pumpkin thing uh, that is easy to make. I found it on the internet, and um, and the current book that I'm using is this one. Let me show it to you. Is this book? This is is, is a book. It's used book that I I found in a, a bookstore, uh, and uh, it was uh, half of the price. This is nice because it has over 40, 400 contemporary and traditional stitch pa pa uh, stitches. And this is the other. Let me show it to you. This is the other book. Oh, sorry. This is the other book that I'm, I'm using. This is only two, 200 stitches. But it's gonna more tell you with more details how to do it. So those are my main uh, book stitches that I'm using. But uh, let me tell you, I like this one. This is more detail. But sometimes I like to figure out how to do it, and I I use this right now. But both are are great. And let me show you here. This is my second kind of second um, my second block, big block about to I'm starting stitching again. I mean embellishing. So it's a it's a it's a it's a great work. I like it because I allow me to do. For example, listen videos or, or lectures about things that I like to hear. So that is for now. And I hope you enjoy it. And see you soon. Bye.